Scorpion's XO 1400 Air Carbon has been out for a couple of years now and it is a belter. But look at this. We have two brand new colours to look at. Oh, and they're beauties. To it, allow me to introduce you to Carbon Blue and Carbon Red. Carbon is the most important word here, isn't it? Because this is a carbon shell. And I know what some of you are probably thinking, oh yeah, it says it's carbon shell, but it's a carbon thing on the outside. <laughs> uh, uh, uh. No, no, no. This is a full carbon shell throughout. And that is why it remains so light. I mean, just playing with it like this, I mean, it's like it's made of air. See what I did there. But anyway, yep. The shell is full carbon. We have some pretty serious looking vents here, operated thusly, uh, with an exhaust at the back. We also have the front vent right here too. And to be honest with you, apart from the side here that controls the internal sun visor, as you can hear, clunk, clunk, there you go, coming down. Apart from that, there's not a great deal else to say about these and the outside, apart from, Look at that, because it is, these are both gorgeous. You should see them when we've got even more lights on them. They just sparkle beautifully, so they will look great on your head out and about. Okay, obviously it's a helmet, so it comes with a visor. And as you can see, we have a tinted one here. Now, if you go to close the visor like so, it will close a, cer a certain amount, okay? If you want to lock it down, simple as that. And to lift it up, Simple as that as well. Now, these visors have been optically refined, but you don't just get a tinted visor, you also get a clear one. Furthermore, what you also get is a Pinlock Max Vision 120. What the hell does that mean, you're saying? Okie dokie. So, right, many different levels and tiers of Pinlocks, and the number relates to how long it will take where if you have a helmet that is completely blocked up with no airflow whatsoever, and you're in, sat at traffic lights in summer, sweating your dongles off, the 120 means it will take roughly two minutes to steam up, if it steams up at all. But the good news here for the Scorpion is the fact that it comes with about the best pin lock you can get. And that's in the box, along with the tinted visor. So how much does this weigh, you're asking? Well, that will be 1,250 grams, and there are three shell sizes, which means they can accommodate a lot of heads. Now, delving onto the inside, inside here we have something called the Quick Wick 3. Now, you're probably thinking, hmm, Quick Wick. Well, yes, it is indeed quick at wicking away sweat and stuff like that. Um, when it comes to the Quick Wick line, this is basically the best it can get. So not only are they throwing the best pin lock in here, you've also got the best interior that you can get too. We have a double D attachment here, which is great. And there are also spaces around where the ears are specifically made for communication systems. So if you want to put speakers in, there's room, don't worry. And then we have the PS de la Resistance, as far as I'm concerned, when it comes to Scorpions. And that is the air fit system. Something which I will admit I once found as a bit of a joke when they first started, however many years ago it was, is actually really handy. So, if we are to look, Mr. Camera, in here, we see there's a big red button. So you pop the helmet on, you're thinking, oh, I could just do with a bit more fit, right? Well, here we go, ready? So you can pump it up, and what it does is it fits to your face perfectly, but there's another use for this. Um, let's say you've been wearing this helmet two or three years a lot, and let's say the cheek pads have molded to you and started to go, not loose, but you know, a little looser as helmets do, and you're a bit tight. So you don't want to buy new ones, even though you really should. That is what this system can help with. It can keep the helmet always as tight to your face as you want. And then the absolute best part, I'm going to go up by the microphone here for this, is when all's said and done, at the end of the day, you get a great fart joke. Ready? Uh, that never gets old. And as far as safety systems go as well, they also have, as you can see here, because it says so, 
emergency, emergency. This is like the quick release system. So if you're having a bit of a lie down, shall we say, and somebody needs to remove your helmet quickly and easily, out it comes and your helmet can be removed off. And I'll tell you what's gonna happen when that does. The person who removes your helmet will be very concerned for you, but they will remove your helmet and then go, God, that looks great, because they do. It's really hard to actually get across. And I'm hoping that the camera is picking up just how lush these look. They are stunning. So what have we learned about the new colorways? Well, one thing I have learned, funnily enough, from a friend of mine is when she saw this, she went absolutely batty over it, probably because it might have matched her hair a little bit, but she'd actually seen the plain carbon one beforehand and gone, oh, that's amazing. And then I pointed out this one. And before any of you say anything, this is not a continuity error. We know there is a different visor on. We just want to show what it is like with a black visor on too. And it looks absolutely stunning. One other great piece of news worth mentioning is that these come with a five year warranty. And that's not one where you have to register online or give your birth details or anything like that. You literally, you buy it, you've got your five year warranty and that should cover the life, the useful life of the helmet, especially if you use it all the time. So there we go, an awesome full carbon helmet. Which color would you like? Go have a look at bikerheads.co.uk.